Hi, I'd like to read Surprising Swimmers. This book is published by Scholastic. The author is Emma Ryan. Surprising Swimmers. This book is a nonfiction story. Forget fish. Have you ever seen an elephant swim? Did you know that lots of other animals can swim too, like pigs and tigers? Want to find out more? Dive in to see which creatures go wild for water. <clears throat> cat. Though many cat, cats can swim, most don't like getting wet. Even giving a cat a bath can be a challenge for pet owners. However, the Turkish fan, also known as the swimming cat, doesn't mind at all. Tiger. Even though most domestic cats don't like the water, the largest cat in the world is a good swimmer. Tigers can usually be found living near water. They'll take a dip to cool off when it is hot outside. Pig. You've probably heard of the doggy paddle, but what about the piggy paddle? Not only do pigs swim, but there's even a place nicknamed Pig Island in the Bahamas where visitors can pay to swim with them. Elephant. You might be surprised to learn that elephants are excellent swimmers. They actually use their long trunk as a snorkel for breathing. They also use their trunk to soak up water and spray it on themselves to cool off. Polar bear. You've probably seen polar bears swimming at the zoo, but do you know why they're so good at it? They have webbed feet similar to a duck's feet which help them paddle through the water. Horse. It's definitely unusual to see a horse swimming, but water is a common treatment for injured horses, especially for ones that race. Exercising in giant pools can help horses with pain. Dog. Did you know that not all dogs can swim? Some breeds are better at it than others. Labrador retrievers and golden retrievers are good swimmers because of their strong legs. Bulldogs and dachshunds have short legs, making it hard for them to stay afloat. Sea snake. Sea snakes are natural born swimmers. Their tail helps them travel easily in the water. Unlike fish, snakes do not have gills, so they have to come up regularly for air to breathe. Sea otter. When they're not hunting or swimming, these talented mammals can eat and sleep while floating on their back. Penguin. Penguins are birds that can't fly but they can definitely swim. Their wings are used like flippers and their feathers help them keep warm in cold water. Snow monkey. Snow monkeys like to live in big groups and spend time on the ground and in trees. What else do they like? Swimming. The snow monkey exhibit at the Central Park Zoo in New York City has a hot tub and a pond. American bullfrog. Bullfrogs are a type of frog with strong back legs and webbed feet that are perfect for swimming. Bullfrogs can usually, they are usually green and have splotches on their back legs. Hippo. Hippos spend most of their lives in and around water that's not too deep. Their eyes, ears, and nostrils are located on top of their head so they can see, hear, and breathe while their body stays cool underwater. Animals that swim go in the water for different reasons. 
Some animals are looking for food, some are traveling, and some just want to cool off. Others take a dip for fun, just like humans.